I am trying to get some videos in today of some trailers. The lot's a little full and there's no one here to move them for me. So I apologize that I'm close to some other things, but I think we'll still be able to get a good idea about this trailer. And it's certainly one we know, um, but this is a used one. So I just wanted to go ahead and get some video um, this morning, even though there's no one here to move them for me. This is a 2022 Gore two horse bumper pull with a side ramp and a dressing room. The trailer is available at Trailer Country LLC in Carrollton, Virginia. This trailer is on consignment with us. It is very, very, very gently used. Um, so I want to get some video and show you what kind of features it has. If you're not familiar with the Gore trailer, the Gore bumper pulls are a galvanized steel chassis. So that's going to be the main frame of the trailer only is a galvanized steel. The rest of the trailer is aluminum frame and aluminum skin. Uh, the trailer has a fiberglass roof. The inside walls of the trailer are also going to be aluminum. Sometimes on those steel framed or steel chassis trailers, you see that the inside walls are steel. And then when the horses run their teeth on them or they get marked up, you're still going to see those trailers rust a little bit. On this trailer, you're not going to get that on the inside or the outside skin because they are aluminum inside and out. Also on the Gore trailer, they are an insulated wall. Um, so your side walls of the trailer are going to be insulated. They have a fiberglass roof, which by nature is just gonna be much cooler than aluminum. So even your insulated aluminum roofs are not gonna be quite as cool as this fiberglass. They just don't absorb and radiate heat quite like aluminum does. Um, again, this is a 2022. It is a very gently used model. Um, it was purchased, used about four times, brought here on consignment as the daughter is going off to boarding school. So if you can't tell, the stripes here are black, red, and hunter green on a white skin. In typical Gore fashion, we have all the options, all the windows and the graphics. Uh, Mr. Gore is always gonna put windows in the nose of that trailer, nice sliding windows, um, sliding hip windows and a sliding window on the dressing room door. We've got diamond plate on the nose and nice wide diamond plated running boards. So these fit a little larger foot, easier to get on and off of without slipping off. Diamond plate here on your fender box as well. We have a full-size escape door street side on this trailer. This is a trailer that Mr. Gore calls a 3A. It is the side ramp bumper pull with a dressing room. Again, full-size escape door. I apologize for the footprints. It's been a little muddy around here. Um, that's the side ramp here in this trailer. I'll show you that again from the outside. Side ramp with a top door. We've got some tie loops here in the front as well as over the side ramp here on the center post and over the escape door. Those are things we can add anywhere that there's a support in the truck, excuse me, sub structure. Um, we can add those tie loops to the trailers, any trailer. We've got nice padded dividers, padded sidewall, padded breast and butt bars. The gore is not standard with a head divider, so if that's important to you, just take a note of that. It's certainly something we can add in solid or bar style, but it's not standard on your gore trailer. We have LED interior lights. We're gonna have an LED load light on the back, porch lights over the side ramp and or dressing room. Strap here for your side ramp. Again, nice long sliding hip windows, sliding windows and the rear top curtains. The trailer does have a ramp on the back and then top curtains. Uh, we have five feet of space here in front of the horses. So your typical headroom in a trailer is gonna be three feet. We've got a seven foot horse area, three feet of headroom, and then we have an additional two feet here. So that's five feet from the breast bar to the front wall with the windows in between the horse area and the dressing room. And we've got some D rings here so that you can strap some things to the front wall of this trailer and keep them out of the way. Your wheelbarrow, some hay, some bedding, whatever you like. Um, you've got five feet there in front of the breast bar, whereas your typical room is gonna be three feet. So we've got extra storage there. LED running lights. This trailer has 3,500 pound axles, which is gonna be pretty standard on a two horse bumper pull. Again, that rear ramp with the top curtains, you can see that little LED load light up there. I apologize, we're looking directly into the sun. This particular trailer is seven, six tall and six foot wide. Owned by people that do the hunters and have warm blood horses. No issues fitting those trailer, those horses in this trailer at all. Again, the trailer is only for sale because the daughter is going to boarding school. I have a spare tire mounted here with a cover on the outside. Tie backs for your rear curtains and your side curtain. 
horse area tie there underneath of the window. There's that side ramp. I can get you a measurement on that side ramp. I'm gonna tell you it's between 48 and 54 inches, but I would need to double check that. Step here into the dressing room. On the other side, you have a full length running board, but obviously with the side ramp, that doesn't work here. I'm not sure if this has been cleaned out yet. Uh, two saddle racks, tons of bridle hooks. There's that window between the horse area and the dressing room. A clothing bar above the saddle racks. Crank out roof vent, LED light inside, those nose windows, and a blanket bar because Mr. Gore always outfits these trailers as much as he can. We've got a rubber mat on the dressing room floor because that's the right answer there. And our lights are mounted inside of the dressing room. Excuse me, our light switches. Nice size dressing room in this trailer. Adding that side ramp really hasn't taken away anything. Camper style door with a screen door here. Again, those stripes are black, red, hunter green. This is a 2022 Gore. It is on consignment here at Trailer Country LLC in Carrollton, Virginia. I apologize again for not putting those ramps down. I'm just in a little bit of a cramped space, but I wanted to go ahead and get this video out and we'll have some photographs when someone can move the trailer for me. Trailers at Trailer Country LLC in Carrollton, Virginia. You can see the specs at trailercountryllc.com. Give us a call if you have any questions.